Hi everybody, this is Joe from Joe's Premium Firewood bringing you another fun-filled exciting video today. In today's video I'm going to test out the modification of my saw buck here. Um, before it was just the two out, outside uh, pillars or X's and there's like about a four foot gap in here and so um, I couldn't cut the pieces to the length that I wanted so I added these two 2x4s here in the middle to give it more stability when I'm cutting it and then I can cut it into the length that I want and I think it'll work out good and uh, I've got some more of these these are all the ones that I'm gonna cut today so we'll set this up over here in the quad and hopefully the camera doesn't fall down or turn off when I set it down and so uh, have at it here. Hope that's good. Appears to be working pretty good. And check out my new t-shirt. Doesn't that look nice? And the reason I'm cutting all this dried up wood is uh, there's an old Chinese proverb that says, desperate times call for desperate measures. And I'm starting to run out of my dried wood, dried or seasoned wood. I have this pile right here. It's about a truckload. I have this stack right here that's ready. And that's about a truckload. And then I have that back wall there. And that's about two truckloads. And that's it. And you can see my uh, trailer has some technical difficulties. The bearing went out in the tire made in China, so I got to have another one of those, uh, buy another one of those. But I know this wood I'm cutting right now isn't the prettiest wood com compared to normal JPS. But you know, it, the two most important things in firewood is the species. Actually, the number one thing is how dry it is. And you can see how dry this wood is. As soon as I split it, it'll be ready. So the dryness of the seasoning and then the species. So it's not going to be as pretty as this wood I got here, but it'll be ready for market. Because this pile right here won't be ready until, like, March. 
And this rack right here, the three, there's probably three truckloads right there. And that'll be ready in around December. And this pile here will be ready in March. And this pile right here will be ready in probably a year or like September of next of 2013. And these logs right here I'll probably split split in the springtime and they, they should be ready around October of 2013. And as soon as I get done cutting them limb logs today, I'm gonna cut this up and uh, these logs over here and put them into this, finish up this stack right here and that'll uh that'll be ready in probably uh march also six months from now so uh, i got a lot of work left to do uh as you can see oh and these right here this hickory and this walnut i'm going to split probably later this week and uh put it in between those two trees right there and that'll be ready in a year or so so I hope you enjoyed today's video, and I need to get back to work, and I hope my, uh, my buddy Ken Case is working also. Have a good day. Oh, and as always, like Joe's Premium Firewood on Facebook.